Welcome to Learn Guitar Tunes. Thanks for tuning in. Today's lesson is Angie, uh, Rolling Stones, obviously. Um, I thought I'd do a Rolling Stones song as it is 50 years Rolling Stones have been together, performing, playing live, recording, etc. So, yeah, I wanted to really do a Rolling Stones song, and this is my favourite Rolling Stones tune to play on acoustic guitar. Um, it's uh, I'm going to be doing an intro for you, I'll then be going through the um, verse chords, chorus chords and the bridge at the end so it's a really nice song to play on the guitar. If you're a learner, beginner, whatever you are, intermediate, and you play acoustic guitar a lot, you have to play this song because it is absolutely fantastic to play on the guitar. So I hope you enjoy it, it's uh, Rolling Stones, Angie and um, let's get on with the lesson. Okay so for Angie um, we're going to focus on the intro to start off with <clears throat> and the chord where the intro starts is an A minor Okay, so you can start it off with an A minor. Before you play the A minor, um, they do a harmonic 12. So what you do is you don't press down in that 12th fret, you're kind of holding the string just slightly. To make that beginning noise, which is a harmonic 12th fret, place your finger, index finger, slightly on the pin, but not pressing down, so like hovering on like that. I'll take my finger off, it still rings. So when you play that, you then go up to an A minor. You can still probably hear it ringing. And then you strum into the first part of that intro, which is the A minor. When you're playing the A minor, we want to be bringing in a sus. So the first thing you want to be doing is hitting the uh, E string, putting your pinky onto the 3rd fret and then lifting so you're sussing, so like this ok, do that again so once you've done the kind of sus on this A minor, kind of just strum your A minor slightly, so nice little strums as soon as you do that sus, you then hit an open E when you've hit the open E, it gives you a split second to get into the next shape. You want to grab your index finger, put it on the 3rd fret of the B, and then place your middle finger on the 4th fret of the G. And that's uh, an E7. What we do is to get from that shape to the other, here's the A minor. Hit the open E, then move into the shape. So that's what we want to be doing. So starting from the G, you just pick the, the G, B, E, B, then back on the E again, but this time either place your thumb on the 4th fret or, if you want to, your ring finger. When you hit that E on the 4, you then strum down from the D. I'll play that shape again. So the first thing you hit is the open E. That's the second part then that we do on that intro. The next part of this, we're now going to be placing our ring finger on the fifth fret, going across like that, diagonally, almost like an F. This next part uh, kind of comes very soon after the second part that I just showed you. So this bit's nice and easy really. Um, once you're in that kind of shape there, going diagonally up from the B all the way across to the D like so, going across the third, the fourth and the fifth frets, we, we pick from the D going down to the E and strum. And on the strum we want to do a slide. So this is how we do it. We want to do the slide up to that F shape starting from the D and then strum on that F as well so I'll do it slowly all together now what we've done so far sus then the E That's what we've done so far. So next, we're now in this shape. The next bit is you want to bring your pinky 
and tuck it underneath ring finger on the G of the third and we're just literally going to be doing some strums from the D down so so the first thing we do is half that slide tuck it under one strum lift it next strum then lift your ring finger off and place your middle finger on the second fret of the D and then stretch your ring finger over to the A of the third into a C so I'm going to go through that again from that slide pinky under pinky lift as soon as you play that C we're then going to be picking from the A of the third fret A D G lift bring middle finger up to second fret A D G and then straight into A minor this is what that looks like from that slide so the next bit when you go straight back into that A minor sus again and this time, instead of doing what we did beforehand, and then straight onto the fifth fret, you want to now be bringing in your index finger and your middle finger on the E and the B of the fifth fret. On the fifth fret, E and the B, okay, it's one, two, three, strum those two three times. One, two, three, exactly the same shape up to the third fret. One, two, and then back to the 5th fret, but this time covering the B and the G. And you do that once. So I'll play that with the A minor together. You then come into that kind of F shape again, straight this time, straight away this time. So again, 3rd fret of the B. 4th fret of the uh, G, 5th fret of the D. This time you're just strumming it, and you strum it um, five times. So it's one, two, three. On the fourth, bring pinky in, like we did up here on the first time. Pinky comes in on the 5th fret of the G, four, and lift again, five. And then it's that slide, and then you repeat what we did beforehand. Okay, so let's run through everything we've done so far now with both of those uh, intro riffs that I've just showed you. So here we go. E minor, the sus, open E, and the F shape, slide, pinky in, pinky off, A7, C. Second time around, A minor again, sus, this time, fifth fret, third, fifth, the F shape, pinky, off, A7, C. I hope that was all clear, there's quite a bit to do there, but it's, uh, it's really nice. Okay, so now I'm going to run through the verse and the chords. The song starts off with an A minor. Angel. And when you do it, I when I play the song, I do bring in the sus. So, Angel. then it goes up to an E seven. So what I do with my E seven is an E seven. You're coming on with your index finger on the G of the first fret and you want to bring your um, middle finger on the A of the second fret like that so the first strum I strum like that then I bring in my pinky on the B of the third fret so, and it goes up to G when will those clouds F sus4 so the G is just a normal G Okay. And then, 
the next chord goes into an F suspended fourth. F suspended fourth, um, you're basically barring with your index finger across the um, E and the B on the first fret. Then you bring your middle finger up on the G of the second fret. And then your pinky comes in on the D of the third. And your ring finger goes on top of the pinky there on the A on the third. If that's too difficult um, with the barring, you can, if you want, to just have your index finger on the B there of the first. So that's your next chord after the G. When will those clouds disappear? There's a different transition, or quite a difficult transition, change there. You're going from this F sus4 to then a bar chord F to then into a C. So run through those chords again. So it's A minor, E7, G, F sus4, F, the barring, barring the F, C. They're your verse chords, okay? So now for the chorus and the chords. The chorus starts off with a G. It goes G, and it goes down to D minor. It goes to A minor. C. It does an F. And then back to a G. With no loving in our souls. D minor. No money in our A minor. Cults. You can say we're satisfied. Um, so that's your chorus. I hope that's pretty clear. There's quite a lot of choruses in this song. Um, but it's a, it's a great chorus. So the last bit of the uh, lesson is the bridge of the song. And the bridge is very much near the very end of the song. It starts off with um, a D minor. And I'll quickly play it so you have an understanding how it goes. But Angie, I still love you baby If you are looking to your eyes there ain't no one that comes close to you Come on baby, dry your eyes and Then back into a verse Angel Okay, so the bridge Starts off with D minor So it goes But Angel Still love you baby A minor Then when you do the A minor Strumming, strumming along do the sus, off, and at the end of that last drum, just lift your index finger, like so. So let's do that again. D minor. But Angel, I still love you, baby. And it's a quick G, then C. Come on, baby. F, dry your eyes. G. And that's it.